Hi children, welcome back to your class. Today we are going to study part two, lesson three, part two. Then from tasting to digestion. In previous class we have to discuss different tastes. Today we are going to study digestion. Digestion in the part two. Then we have to uh, learn some of digestive parts. Human Digestive system. That means to manage, manage, and then human digestive system includes some organs. First one is mouth, food by stomach, small intestine, large intestine, rectum, and anus. Then diaphragm. Then this is the diaphragm of uh, human digestive system. First one is mouth. Then this food goes to food pipe of esophagus. Then comes in stomach. Then small intestine. Then large intestine. A rectum. And then goes out anus. Then first we discuss mouth. Mouth. Uh, mouth includes three parts. That is teeth, tongue, and salivary glands. This is already learned. First. Part one. Mouth. What is the uh, function of mouth? Mouth helps to uh, chew, chew and swallow the food. Then what is digestion? The process by which the complex food we take changes into simple soluble form and energy is released. That means digestion means complex substance uh, split into simple form and Reduced energy. This process is called digestion. Then digestion starting with the mouth, food by stomach, small intestine, large intestine, rectum, and anus. Then first, uh, then mouth, then food is to uh, teeth helps to chew the food and swallow the food and then goes to food by then. Mouth. What is the function of mouth? Digestion begins in mouth when the food mixes with saliva. Our digestion first is starting mouth and food mixes with saliva. Saliva means lab. Then stomach. Stomach uh, inside one acid present. This acid is HCl. HCl means hydrochloric acid. Hydrochloric acid. HCl means hydrochloric acid present. This acid help to digest our food. Then some um, food are uh, digest completely digested some. Then some are partially digested some. This partially digested or undigested food goes to small intestine. That means Undigested food is goes to um, small intestine. Digested food goes into the blood and undigested food to large intestine. That means small intestine. Then stomach inside uh, partially digestion completed. Then small intestine digestion ends. Then some undigested food goes into large, large intestine. Large intestine it absorbs water and undigested food is given out as waste through rectum and an opening called anus. That means undigested food is mixed with in lab in the same and salt and water. It is mixed into uh, then goes to rectum then goes outside the waste through anus or urine and urea. These are the part of human digestive system. In your textbook page number 27, how do you come to know that you are hungry? Then how to feel you are hungry? Then an empty feeling stomach. Stomach feeling empty. That time you have to feel hungry. Think what would happen if you do not eat anything for two days without food in two days. What's the feeling? Become weak and 
for e with a b candle for e then next page page number 28 needle marks given as glucose drip you have here this word glucose yes needle marks very see all day she was vomiting and she also had loose motion whatever she ate she vomited her father gave her sugar and salt solution by evening needle was feeling weak and dizzy when the when she got up to go to the doctor if she fainted her father had to carry her to the doctor the doctor said that needle should get admitted in the hospital she needs to be given a glucose drip here in this needle got confused she knew sometimes gave them glucose to drink but not was a glucose drip that means uh, needle one girl there she was uh, very sick and uh, she was vomiting and loose motion then uh, their father gave her sugar and salt solution then after evening she not well then they go to hospital and admit the hospital the doctor do glucose drip then glucose means glucose is a kind of food that gives instant energy what is the use of function of glucose glucose give glucose give instant energy under the kind of food there glucose is give the instant energy glucose is a kind of food that gives instant energy then have you heard the word glucose or see written anywhere yes you have to see in the word glucose and see it written on glucose packets then various advertisements of tv and news papers then page number 30 a story a stomach with a window in the poem you read about a soldier called marty in 1822 he was 18 years old and was very healthy when he was shot he got seriously hurt at that time dr newman was told to treat him dr newman cleaned the wound and put the dressing after one and a half years the doctor found that martin's wound had healed expert for one thing he had a big hole in his stomach the hole was covered with a loose flap of skin like the washer in a football press the skin and we put that means uh, um, doctor uh, bluman uh, one soldier there martin there stomach have wound there this wound is open and flap there skin flap in there then she was taking her how to digest our food then what is uh, what does our stomach do our stomach uh, churns the food to digest it uh, stomach churns to food to digest it then another important is good food give good health our good food give good health good
He does not like to eat home cooked food like dal rice, vegetables and roti. The only thing he find taste are chips, burger, pizza and soft drinks from the market. You have to see two children there, Rashmi and Kailash. Rashmi has no food there and less amount of food eating but Kailash then uh, homemade food not eat the outside food eating example chips burger pizza then um, children's need is proper food what is proper food the food that is needed for proper growth and development of a child is called proper food that means proper food contain uh, or proper food needed for proper growth and development of a child proper growth and development of a child is for child is called proper food then every child's right is proper food that means every child what is the right of every child proper food then why can you not taste food properly when you have a cold cold can you have not feel taste why our nose gets blocked and thus we cannot smell properly that means that time our nose is blocked and cannot smell properly okay then our uh, third lesson finish and once more remind this lesson and now uh, first portion we study different taste what are they salty sour sweet and bitter then next uh, study uh, what is the use of teeth teeth help to chew our food then uh, tongue tongue what is the function of tongue then it helps to speak and gives taste of different food items then saliva or salivary glands salivary glands uh, mix up with saliva mixes the food then goes into the food pipe that means water water there in our mouth this water is called the saliva then 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 the human digestive system human digestive system include mouth food pipe stomach small intestine large intestine rectum and anus then mouth is help to uh, eat the food and to the goes to food pipe then stomach contain one acid there hydrochloric acid this help to digest the food then um, small intestine digestion complete or ends here then large intestine Uh, they absorb undigested food and it gives water and salt then goes to rectum then uh, then comes outside to anus then next is study how to eat good food it gives you good health then next is glucose glucose is a kind of food that it gives instant energy then next is what is the right of every child proper Food. Okay. Thanks a lot.